The Giants' old friend Odell Beckham was released by the Cleveland Browns on Friday morning, leading to a lot of wild speculation about where he might end up next, even some wishful thinking from some about him getting a reunion with the Giants. But I think you can forget about that. The Giants have been there, done that with the Mercurial star. And while he does still have supporters and friends in the Giants organization, there are a lot of people that remember the Beckham experience from a few years ago and just are not eager to relive it. It was a very, very bumpy ride and in the end, not worth it at all to them and not worth it at all to them to bring him back even though they need receiving help right now. There's a couple of reasons why Odell Beckham wouldn't be it. A big one is he is just not the same player anymore. He is not the Odell Beckham of the Giants era, the spectacular breakaway player who was as dynamic as any offensive star in the league. Injuries have battered him. He has not been productive. He looks slower than he was. All of it says that he's not going to come in and energize the Giants offense. The bigger reason, though, is the baggage that he brings. He has now been dumped by two organizations, alienated two starting quarterbacks, and ticked off two head coaches. And obviously, one of each of those was on the Giants, so they know how disruptive he can be. And to expect that if he wasn't happy when their offense was better and they had a two-time Super Bowl champion at quarterback years ago, how happy is he going to be coming in now when the offense is struggling and Daniel Jones is still growing? And to be honest, when Kadarius Toney, Kenny Galladay, Saquon Barkley are all healthy, Beckham would come in as a bit part. So... That doesn't make any sense. This is not a place where he's going to find bliss. Maybe with a contender, he can provide a short-term spark. There certainly will be some teams, the Saints, the Packers, for example, that are looking for receivers that might decide to either claim Beckham or sign him once he clears waivers. But the Giants just make no sense at all. They are building towards a better future with young players. They have their core of receivers when it's healthy. It's one of their strengths. They don't need Beckham to come in. He wouldn't help them that much on the field. He could be a disruption off of the field. And again, they've lived it before. No one there is eager to live it again.